What's going on everybody? How are you people doing here? Welcome back to another recap of a Bayern game. So I'm going to be recapping the fourth and the Bayern game. So what can I say about tonight's game and Bayern? They once again gave off a pretty uh, all right performance. I guess you could say, you know, we conceded a goal late in the match, but for the most part, we looked pretty dominant today on scoring another one of those games where we were able to drop at least three goals against the opposition. But for the most part, I hope that against Dynamo Kiev, Stanisic is going to start because once again today, Pavard just gave off a very inconsistent performance. That was just a very bad challenge by Pavard and then he he got a red card. So I think this goes to show you why I personally trust Stanisic more as a right back compared to Pavard because with Pavard I feel like that he's just way too inconsistent to be a constant starter at fullback for us which is why I prefer us to give the starting position to Stanisic because I personally think that Stanisic has been performing way better as a fullback compared to Pavard. So which is why starting Stanisic more makes sense. And speaking of Stanisic you know he committed to playing for Croatia instead of Germany I believe you know for their national football team because I think Stanisic was eligible to represent either Germany or Croatia. Croatia, but he decided to commit to Croatia. So who knows, maybe Stanisic once again will be able to be part of another Croatian golden generation again. So for the most part today, it looked like we kind of underperformed at times because I've been reading the player ratings and so far, but I think it's because, you know, uh, we are basically saving our energy for the game against Dynamo Kiev in the Champions League qualifier. So I think that probably explains why, you know, we didn't like give off too much of like a, uh, a consistent performance tonight, even though we won the game three to one. Because I looked at the player ratings and like I said before, I feel like that's sometimes, you know, when it comes to these Bundesliga games, you know, player ratings, I think, don't really mean anything. All that matters is how our players can perform in the Champions League qualifiers and then, you know, the knockouts. Because with the Bundesliga games, it's like a 99% certainty that Bar would almost every Bundesliga game. So player ratings for Bundesliga games, I feel like, are kind of irrelevant. And in other news, Lewandowski, he won the Golden Boot. So, hey, he deserved it, man. Lewandowski once again, proving why he deserves every trophy in the books added to his name and all that good stuff. And when it came to that third goal, I thought Lewandowski was going to be credited with the third goal, but apparently that was an own goal. And also, I've been reading that apparently we were so close to signing Timo Werner in 1819, but I think, you know, because of lack of support from the Bayern front office, he pulled out at the last minute. So I don't know why, but you know, hey, I wouldn't mind us getting Timo Werner if we don't get Holland.